Please be seated. Good morning. Welcome to the doctoral hooding ceremony at the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. I am Wojtek Hodzko Zajko, Dean of the Graduate College. As a land-grant institution, the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign has a responsibility to acknowledge the historical context in which it exists. In order to remind ourselves and our community, we will begin this event with the following statement. We are currently on the lands of the Peoria, Kaskaskia, Piankashaw, Wea, Miami, Maskutin, Odawa, Sauk, Meskwaki, Kickapoo, Potawatomi, Ojibwe, and Chickasaw nations. It is necessary to acknowledge these nations and for us to work with them as we move forward as an institution. Over the next 150 years, we will be a vibrant community inclusive of all of our differences with Native people at the core of our efforts. Today, we gather to celebrate our doctoral graduates and their truly impressive accomplishments. We also want to thank the family, friends, mentors, and colleagues of the graduates who have joined us today, either in person or via the live stream of this event. You have been part of the broad network of support that is so important throughout each of the graduates' academic progress. Let us please give a round of applause to thank everyone who has been part of this journey. I would like to introduce the members of the platform party this morning who will stand as their names are called. Please hold your applause until they have all been introduced. Robert Jones, Chancellor. William Bernhardt, Interim Vice Chancellor for Academic Affairs and Provost. Paulan Jushkovich, Associate Vice Chancellor for Advancement. Sean Garrick, Vice Chancellor for Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion. Susan Martinez, Vice Chancellor for Research and Innovation. Jia Chen, Professor of Cell and Developmental Biology. Zeynep Madak Erdogan, Associate Dean in the Graduate College. Herman Bolero, Dean Designate of the College of Agricultural, Consumer, and Environmental Sciences. Reggie Alston, Associate Dean of the College of Applied Health Sciences. Anne Thompson, Director of the Accountancy PhD Program in the Geese College of Business. Kristala Musa, Dean of the College of Education. Rashid Bashir, Dean of the Granger College of Engineering. Kevin Hamilton, Dean of the College of Fine and Applied Arts. Stephen Downey, Associate Dean of the School of Information Sciences. Ingrid Fulmer, Dean of the School of Labor and Employment Relations. Verity Winship, Senior Associate Dean for Academic Affairs in the College of Law. Venetria Patton, Dean of the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences. Christopher Prom, Interim Dean of Libraries. Amanda Siafone, Director of Graduate Studies for the Institute of Communications Research in the College of Media. Gregory Politis, Executive Vice Dean in the Carl Illinois College of Medicine. Peter Constable, 
Dean of the College of Veterinary Medicine. Thank you for your leadership and dedication to our graduate students. It is my honor to introduce Dr. Robert Jones, Chancellor of the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. This thing is so heavy, I almost lost my balance there for a minute. Let me start by saying good morning. As the Chancellor of the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign, it is certainly my great honor. In fact, it's a great privilege to me to be able to offer you my congratulations on the completion of your doctoral studies. Yes, give yourselves a round of applause. Yes, absolutely. You know, I think we all would agree that today is a, an enormous personal and professional milestone. And at this particular moment, many of you are probably sitting there with the feeling of pride that is only matched by an enormous sense of relief. But trust me, that balance will quickly change. Now, the relief part will surely fade, but the pride, that deep sense of pride, I want you to trust me on this as well, that feeling of pride and accomplishment will only grow stronger in the days and the months and the years to come. So I encourage you to joyfully and confidently embrace that pride because you have earned a doctoral degree from one of the very best and the most rigorous universities on this planet. And it would be impossible to offer these congratulatory comments without recognizing that you have completed and accomplished this task in the midst of the worst global health crisis in living memory. So for that alone, I think you deserve to brag at least a little bit about that honor. And you most certainly, most certainly deserve a very enthusiastic round of applause from all of us that are here today to celebrate with you. I would also want to take just a moment to welcome all of the friends and the families who are here today to be part of this celebration, as well as those of you who will be hooding one of these outstanding scholars today. We also want to extend a warm welcome to all of those from around the world who are watching the extreme broadcasts of this ceremony. We are a university that can honestly say that our graduations are celebrations of global proportions. All of us on the platform can certainly attest we don't make it through a doctoral program without a lot of support from those that are around us all along the way. As you all understand today, even if it wasn't clear to you when you first started down this road, the choice of pursuing a doctoral degree requires more than just being a good student and having natural talent. It requires a lot, lot more than that. It requires you to be devoted, to devote everything you have to learning, not just how to be a scholar, it demands that you immerse yourself completely in your discipline. It blurs the line between work and life. And it usually requires you to become accustomed to getting things wrong the first time. Whether that's an unsuccessful experiment or a thesis argument that ultimately proves to be unsupported. 
Becoming a good scholar and a good researcher demands patience and it forces you to develop discipline and a focus that is hard to explain to someone who has not been through it. You are through it now, and this is your chance to fully and loudly celebrate that accomplishment. Thank you for your determination. Because your degree today isn't just an acknowledgement of your personal success, it is a point of pride for every one of us, every one of us on this stage, and in fact, for every member of the university community. You represent Illinois now. You will enjoy a global reputation for inclusive and comprehensive excellence at Illinois. We all enjoy that. And while part of that reputation is certainly earned by the unmatched faculty, a very, very large part, a very large component of it is also carried in the quality and its success and the achievements of our doctoral graduates. Because you are the ones who will expand that Illinois network of faculty and industry leaders and innovators. You are the ones who will send young, outstanding scholars here to pursue their degrees at some point in the future. You represent the very best of academic excellence of the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. And like we find across higher education, the way we honor that kind of achievement and success is with the bestowing of the doctoral hood. It is a moment that I certainly remember in my own career, and it is one that I certainly hope will remain a cherished highlight of yours as well. So on behalf of the entire University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign community, congratulations to you all. Earlier when I introduced the platform party, I missed a critically important member of our leadership team, uh, Vice Chancellor for Student Affairs, Danita Brown-Young. Danita, stand up and let's give her a round of applause. It is now my honor to introduce Dr. William Bernard, Interim Provost and Vice Chancellor for Academic Affairs. Good morning, everyone. Con Congratulations on one of the most significant milestones of your academic career. Earning a doctoral degree is an exemplary academic accomplishment. Today is clearly today a day to celebrate, not just for you, but for your family, friends, and advisors who supported you on this journey. On behalf of our entire university, congratulations to you and to them on this achievement. But today, you're not just getting a degree. You're also getting a new name. From this day forward, you will no longer be known as just Terry Smith. You are Terry Smith, PhD, University of Illinois. That new name will stay with you forever. I graduated over 25 years ago, and I'm still known as Bill Bernhard, PhD, Duke University. My good friend Chancellor Jones over here, you know what they still call him? Robert Jones, PhD, University of Missouri. You will always be known by that name. That new name becomes part of your professional identity, part of who you are. Now we know that names have meaning. My given name, William, comes from the old German uh, and means resolute protector. I'm down with that, that's good. Uh, my teenage son, uh, his name is Ezra, uh, which comes from the old Hebrew and that means helper. Uh, and it's kind of ironic because he does not help around the house at all. <laughs> so let's think about what your new name, PhD University of Illinois, what does that mean? Well, there's the first part, the PhD. Those three letters show that you have made contri a contribution to humanity's body of knowledge. In short, 
you've thunk thoughts that have never been thunk before. And that is brutally cool. So now to make that contribution requires creativity, diligence, and perseverance. Your name, PhD, announces to the world that you are an expert in your field with a passion for discovery and the ability to design and implement long-term projects. In many ways, it is the ultimate summary of your achievements and qualifications. And then there's the second part of your new name, University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. That part says you earned your PhD at one of the leading research institutions in the world, a place where internationally renowned experts drive exploration, discovery, innovation, a place that redefines the impossible every day. Earning a PhD from here means that your ideas meet the highest standards of intellectual excellence, that your contributions have survived the most profound scrutiny, and that you are prepared to lead the next generation of inquiry and invention. That part really signals how impressive your achievement is, and it is entirely appropriate to be proud of your alma mater and that achievement. But let me caution you, you should never be arrogant about it. Always, always remember that it is an achievement to earn a PhD from any institution, even the University of Michigan. <laughs> but that second part of your name, that University of Illinois, it means more than just bragging rights. It means more because the University of Illinois is more than just a leading research institution. The University of Illinois is a land-grant institution, one of the institutions that was founded with support from the federal government with a specific mission, to educate the great mass of citizens and share our expertise and knowledge with that community. That means our institution and all of those affiliated with it have a special responsibility a responsibility to serve society. And your new name means that you will forever be associated with that land-grant mission and that responsibility. Throughout history, people change their names when they are called to a higher purpose. In the Bible, Abram becomes Abraham, Simon becomes Peter, Saul becomes Paul. In more contemporary times, Cassius Clay, an excellent boxer, becomes Muhammad Ali, a tireless advocate for social justice. So too, your name change today calls you to a higher purpose, the purpose of the University of Illinois, the purpose to use your expertise, your skills, your passion to serve society. So whether you're in academia or in industry, whether you're teaching at Harvard or high school, whether you're running for mayor or coaching your kids' little league team, your name, PhD University of Illinois, means that you are expected to contribute to the betterment of the people around you. So in conclusion, let me just say congratulations. And on behalf of every faculty member, thank you. Thank you for your intellectual curiosity and ambition. It has been an honor for all of us to see you develop as scholars. On behalf of all of our students, thank you for being such an integral part of their education and training. And on behalf of this university, Thank you for taking on the responsibility of your new name. Congratulations. I'm very happy to introduce our keynote speaker, Dr. Jia Chen. Dr. Jia Chen is a professor in the Department of Cell and Developmental Biology at the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign, where she has been a faculty member for 26 years. She is also an affiliate with the Cancer Center at Illinois, the Institute for Genomic Biology, and the Carl Illinois College of Medicine. She received her PhD in biochemistry from Rice University and postdoctoral training at Harvard University. Her research program focuses on the biochemical and cellular mechanisms of regulation of mammalian cell biology. All of her duties and achievements as a faculty member, in all of these, Dr. Chen is most passionate about mentoring and advocating for graduate students. As a department head in the past, and as the Director of Graduate Studies today, the wellness and success of graduate students have always been her top 
priority. And she great, takes great pride in celebrating the successes of her students. Her efforts and passion were recognized by the Provost's Award for Excellence in Graduate Student Mentoring in 2021. Please join me in welcoming our speaker, Dr. Jia Chen. Hello, graduates. You are about to receive the highest degree from one of the top institutions in the world. Congratulations. <laughs> On any day, this is a great achievement, but you, how you got here, took unprecedented grit, resilience, adaptation, and creativity. I'm almost certain that all of you were here on campus in March 2020. What followed in the next two to three years was something none of your generation or my generation had ever experienced. I was where you are now almost exactly 30 years ago to the day, receiving my PhD in biochemistry at Rice University. I had come to the US from China to pursue a doctoral degree. Despite having studied English from middle school through college, I could not even understand news on TV. So to relearn English, I watched Sesame Street every weekend without fail. And then I graduated to watching sitcoms. I'm sure you all agree with me from watching the reruns of Friends and Seinfeld. The 90s was the golden era of sitcoms. <laughs> like many of you international students, I missed home terribly. Calling home cost $3 a minute, which I could not afford on my 10K a year graduate stipend. There was no FaceTime or WeChat or WhatsApp or internet for that matter. But what I went through to complete my PhD was nothing compared to what you had to endure to get here. In the spring of 2020, you were locked up in your apartment, didn't even dare to go grocery shopping for many months. You were constantly worried about your family, whom you could only see on the screen. Some of you may have even lost family members to COVID. You saw your advisor only on Zoom. You probably had to take your prelim exam on Zoom as well, constantly worrying about internet disruption while going through an already nerve-wracking process. If you worked in the lab, you worked on your own with no one there to help you troubleshoot when things went wrong. You had no peer group to celebrate or commiserate with for anything. But you passed that dreaded Pune exam. You completed the last experiment or field work you published your groundbreaking discoveries or ingenious inventions. You held that last recital and you finished writing the last chapter of your thesis. You are here. You are my heroes. <laughs> but you didn't do it alone. For many of you, the person sitting next to you right now most likely played a pivotal role in your development all these years. And your family and friends, some of them here in this room right now or joining us virtually today, put up with your physical or mental absence and supported you unconditionally, even when they had no idea what exactly you were studying. As you leave this cozy nest of Illinois campus, please be kind to yourself. 
Know that you have earned this degree. Don't let anyone tell you what you can or cannot do with your degree. A few years back, one of my PhD students at the cusp of graduating came into my office crying. She had aspired to pursue an academic career. At the beginning of graduate school, she wanted to be just like me. But as she was nearing the end of graduate school, she changed her mind and decided to pursue a career in industry. She thought she had let me down. Imagine my surprise. That's when I became aware of the tremendous pressure that doctoral students put on themselves to meet what they believe to be the expectations of their mentors or others. My only expectation for my former students has always been that they own their degree and seek joy and fulfillment, whether it is teaching high school, serving as CEO in the biotech company, working towards tenure at a prestigious university, writing about science full time, analyzing data for Facebook, or teaching robots how to perform biology experiments. And yes, a PhD in cell biology can get you that job. It's called automation engineer. I am proud of each and every one of them. So own your degree. Do whatever it takes that makes your heart sing. And keep in touch with your mentor. They still have much to offer you and it's not just that letter of recommendation you may need for the next job. My PhD advisor, Kathy Matthews, taught me everything. How to think like a scientist, how to talk like a scientist, how to write like a scientist, how to lead like a scientist, how to dress like a scientist, which is whatever makes me feel like myself. And most of all, she taught me how to be a mentor. At every stage of my career, since I left Kathy's lab, I have turned to her for advice. In fact, I consulted with her when I was contemplating this speech. I am very lucky to have found Kathy in my life. You want to hold on to the Kathys in yours too. And there will be opportunities for mentors of all kinds Throughout your career, just keep your eyes and your heart open and hold on to those you discover. It is also time that you paid it forward. <clears throat> you don't have to be a professor to be a mentor. Many of you here already are experienced mentors having worked with undergraduate students. In whatever career you may choose, you are intellectual powers and compassion can help another young person find their own path. Finally, it would not be a graduation speech if you're not reminded you of your duties. This nation is certainly more divided now than when you were in college. As the intellectuals with the highest academic degree it is your duty to lead with empathy, to transcend race, religion, and political views, to stand up against hatred, and to model ways we can all come together across our many differences to create a new commons for us all. Graduates, I wish you the very best as you embark on your exciting journey of finding a cure for cancer, uncovering nature's secrets from microbes to the human brain, to supernova, engineering marvels from nanotechnology to AI to new cities, tackling the challenges of food security, climate change, and energy sustainability writing that Pulitzer Prize winning book, composing the next masterpiece, mentoring the next generation, 
or pursuing anything else to your heart's content. Just don't forget to be kind to yourself, keep in touch with your mentor, and call your parents every week. Thank you, and con congratulations again. Today we have the distinct privilege of celebrating our graduate students who have earned the highest degree, the doctorate. The hallmark of a doctoral degree is the journey from learner to scholar. It is a journey that requires learning and hard work. But more than that, it is a journey of learning to be bold thinkers, to create and discover new knowledge, and to develop new ways of understanding complex ideas and phenomena. Successfully completing a doctorate is an indicator of perseverance and determination, and to do so with the interjection of a worldwide pandemic is especially exceptional. The graduates we recognize here today have experienced both professional and personal challenges during the course of their studies. Yet, despite those challenges, they have remained steadfast in their goals and accomplishments. Will our doctoral candidates please rise? We thank you for choosing Illinois to pursue your aspirations and for making Illinois part of your journey. Please be seated. The success of these scholars would not be possible without the guidance and dedication of our faculty. On behalf of your, uh, our graduates and my colleagues, I would like to thank you for all that you have done in supporting these leaders. Please, can we have a round of applause for our graduate faculty. The ceremony we enact today is a tradition that dates all the way back to the very beginning of universities in the 13th century. The bestowing of the hood signifies the transition from candidate to colleague. Today, you join the generations of Illinois alumni who are leaders and innovators, impacting the lives of people around the world. As a graduate of this great public land-grant institution, I am confident that each and every one of you will use your knowledge and expertise to shape our future and our society in profound and meaningful ways. I urge you to use your skills and talents to be bold and judicious in all of your future endeavors. It is now my honor to present our graduates. When I call your name, please approach the hooding area with your mentor. If you have not designated a person to hood you, Associate Dean Zeynep Madak Erdogan will hood you. After you have received your hood, continue across the stage to be congratulated by Chancellor Jones, Provost Bernhardt, and the Dean of your college. You may then return to your seat and be seated. Members of the audience, please kindly hold your applause until all the graduates have crossed the stage. Thank you.
Rishab Gupta. Doc I now invite Sorry about that. You're on the spot. Um, I would like to invite Herman Bolero, the Dean of uh, the College of ACES, to come forward and recognize the candidates from that college. That's okay. Once again, Rishabh Gupta, Doctor of Philosophy in Agricultural and Biological Engineering, hooded by Zainet Madak Erdogan. Amir Malvandi, Doctor of Philosophy in Agricultural and Biological Engineering, hooded by Zainab Madak Erdogan. Hiran Chung, Doctor of Philosophy in Agricultural and Applied Economics, hooded by Mary Arens Kuning. Joyce Nyunguna, Doctor of Philosophy in Crop Sciences, hooded by Eric Sachs. Hanya Taha, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by Anna Arthur. Ruben Chavez, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by Matthew Stashevich. Marta Albiol Tapia, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by Jung Su Lee. Aubrey Dunterman, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by Jung Su Lee. Nala Creedley, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by Jung Su Lee. Qian Ying Zhu, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Joanna Alexandra Coronel Laisa, Doctor of Philosophy in Food Science and Human Nutrition, hooded by John Erdman. Tian Ying Kai, Doctor of Philosophy in Human Development and Family Studies, hooded by Kelly Tu. Yanan Hu, Doctor of Philosophy in Human Development and Family Studies, hooded by Nancy McElwain. Sierra La Raglin, Doctor of Philosophy in Natural Resources and Environmental Sciences, hooded by Angela Kent. Tanjila Jasmine, Doctor of Philosophy in Natural Resources and Environmental Sciences, hooded by Richard Mulvaney. Anna Mitchell, Doctor of Philosophy in Nutritional Sciences, hooded by Melissa Flug Prescott. Zhilong Zhao, Doctor of Philosophy in Agricultural Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Ivan Pinos Cabezas, Doctor of Philosophy in Nutritional Sciences, hooded by John Erdman. Leila Shin, Doctor of Philosophy in Nutritional Sciences, hooded by Hannah Holscher. Amira Burton Obanya, Doctor of Philosophy in Nutritional Sciences, hooded by Anna Arthur. Christian Maino Vetis, 
Doctor of Philosophy in Nutritional Sciences, hooded by Anna Arthur. We will now recognize graduates from the College of Applied Health Sciences. I welcome Associate Dean Reggie Alston to come forward. Emily Erlenbach, Doctor of Philosophy in Kinesiology, hooded by Nea Gote. Shelby Key, Doctor of Philosophy in Kinesiology, hooded by Duane Key. Shannon Pennington, Doctor of Philosophy in Kinesiology, hooded by Kevin Richards. Tai Tae Su, Doctor of Philosophy in Community Health, hooded by Shannon Maya. Mon E. Wei, Doctor of Philosophy in Kinesiology, hooded by Kim Graber. Guangzhou Chen, Doctor of Philosophy in Recreation, Sport, and Tourism, hooded by Monika Stodilska. Wanju Li, Doctor of Philosophy in Recreation, Sport, and Tourism, hooded by Mikihiro Saito. <laughs> Jing Jing Wu, Doctor of Philosophy in Recreation, Sport, and Tourism, hooded by Laura Payne and Kimberly Chenu. Brianna Arzuaga, Doctor of Audiology, hooded by Brian Monson. Melanie Flores, Doctor of Audiology, hooded by Brian Monson. Caroline Brennan, Doctor of Audiology, Hooded, hooded by Fatima Hussein. Wu Jae Han, Doctor of Philosophy in Speech and Hearing Science. Hooded by John T. Allen. Kristen Moore, Doctor of Audiology. Hooded by Ian Mertes. Celine Villand, Doctor of Audiology. Hooded by Ian Mertes. Peter Scheiman, Doctor of Audiology. Hooded by Justin Aronoff. We will now recognize graduates from the Geese College of Business. I invite Dr. Ann Thompson to come forward. G.L.O., Doctor of Philosophy in Business Administration, hooded by Joseph Mahoney and Arkady Sakhotov. Chen Chen Di, Doctor of Philosophy in Business Administration, hooded by Yung Chuan Li. Hie Wan O, oh, Doctor of Philosophy in Business Administration, hooded by Ravi Mehta. Ying Ji Yu, Doctor of Philosophy in Finance, hooded by Timothy Johnson. We will now recognize graduates from the College of Education. I invite Dean Kristala Musa to come forward. Amal Elasi, Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, hooded by Sarah McCarthy. <laughs> Kari James, Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, hooded by Sarah McCarthy. Juan Manuel Gerardo, Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, 
hooded by Rochelle Guterres. Sylvia Yang, Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, hooded by Stephanie Sanders Smith. Kutasha Brian Silva, Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction, hooded by Stephanie Sanders Smith. Gabriela Vargas, Doctor of Philosophy in Curriculum Instruction, hooded by Daniel Wong. Chiquita Brown, Doctor of Philosophy in Educational Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Denise Ward Hood. Amari Simpson, Doctor of Philosophy in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by William Trent. Pastor Colonel Antonio Daggett, Doctor of Philosophy in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by William Trent and Kern Alexander. Juan Gardner, Doctor of Education in Educational Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Kern Alexander and his wife, Amber Gardner. Yeah. Alicia Cabrera Prado, Doctor of Philosophy in Educational Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Alison Witt. Brian Egan, Doctor of Education in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, Hooded by Alison Witt. Elizabeth Esser, Doctor of Education in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Alison Witt. Mackenzie Gillespie, Doctor of Philosophy in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Alison Witt. Thaddeus Herman, Doctor of Philosophy in Education Policy, Organization and Leadership, hooded by Linda Herrera. Mike Yuchuan Shen, Doctor of Philosophy in Education Policy and Organizational Leadership, hooded by Linda Herrera. <laughs> Carla Lola McAdam, Doctor of Education in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Yun Park. Noreen Rashid, Doctor of Education in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Yun Park. Marky Garis, Doctor of Education in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by Yoon Park. Keith Stampley, Doctor of Education in Education Policy, Organization, and Leadership, hooded by William Cope and Mary Colansis. Sanchari Banerjee, Doctor of Philosophy in Educational Psychology, hooded by Nidia Ru Ruedas Garcia. Dan Dan Chen, Doctor of Philosophy in Educational Psychology, hooded by Jinming Zhang. Nimot Ogunfemi, Doctor of Philosophy in Educational Psychology, Hooded by Helen Neville. Yeah. 
We will now recognize graduates from the Granger College of Engineering. I invite Dean Rashid Bashir to come forward. Jean-Baptiste Bouvier, Doctor of Philosophy in Aerospace Engineering, hooded by Melchior Orni. Chuanyi Zhang, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Mohammed El Kebir. Rachni Kaur, Doctor of Philosophy in Industrial Engineering, hooded by Richard Sowers. <coughs> Satore Taki, Doctor of Philosophy in Industrial Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Sub Subhendra Vikram Singh Chauhan, Doctor of Philosophy in Aerospace Engineering, hooded by Philip Ansel. Armando Golazo Garcia III, Doctor of Philosophy in Aerospace Engineering, hooded by Philip Ansel. Christopher Coletti, Doctor of Philosophy in Aerospace Engineering, hooded by Philip Ansel. David Fellows, Doctor of Philosophy in Aerospace Engineering, hooded by Daniel Badoni. Neil Parikh, Doctor of Philosophy in Aerospace Engineering, hooded by Nancy Sotos. Yun Jiong, Doctor of Philosophy in Bioengineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Zhao Zhao Wang, Doctor of Philosophy in Bioengineering, hooded by Rashid Bashir. Elena Maria Zanoni, Doctor of Philosophy in Bioengineering, hooded by Ling Jian Meng. Mohammed Abdel Maguid, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Ahmed El Banna. Wen Kong, Doctor of Philosophy in Environmental Engineering in Civil Engineering, hooded by Benito Marinas. Sai Kelyan Avani, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by John Pok Pop Popovics. Sorry. Kartik Pataji, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering hooded by John Popovics. Hong Liang Li, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. <laughs> Nancy Zhou, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Kiran Tekumparampil, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by C. Wong O. Patrick Su, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by John Dallasassi. <coughs> Jose Sanchez Vicarte, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Christopher Fletcher. Caitlin Parsons, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Joe Lyding. Tin Ying Lai, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. 
Yip Ban Hei, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Marcelo Garcia. Andy Herr, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Jeremy Guest. Hannah Lohman, Doctor of Philosophy in Environmental Engineering in Civil Engineering, hooded by Jeremy Guest. Kisuk Kim, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Robin, R Roman Marenko. Nathaniel Levine, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Bill Spencer. Gao Yu Lui, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Larry Farnstock and James Lefebvre. Jose Rivera Perez, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Imad Al Qadi. Zewi Zhu, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Imad Al Qadi. Mandu Alexawi, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Imad Al Qadi. Bavesh Srimali, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Oscar Lopez Pamis. <laughs> Chu Yu Lin, Doctor of Philosophy in Environmental Engineering and Civil Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Ahmed Hassan, Doctor of Philosophy in Civil Engineering, hooded by Ahmed Elbana. Abdel Ejay, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Vikram Advi. Emily Hastings, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Brian Bailey. Kartik Hegdi, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Christopher Fletcher. Gaurush Hiranandani, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by uh, Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Chiao Xie, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Darko Marinov. Unnat Jain, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Svetlana Lazebnik. Sahiti Labhisheti, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Cheng Zhang Zhai and Hari Sundaram. Subham Dei, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Hari Sundaram. Jiang Xiao. Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Hari Sandaram and Kari Karahalios. Sanorita Day, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Kari Karahalios. Huichen Li, 
Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Bo Lee. Shelby Lockhart, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Luke Olson. Sharad Merotra, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by David Padua. Abdul Rahman Hassan Mahmoud, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Sarita Adve. <laughs> Muhammad Huzaifa, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Sarita Adve. <laughs> Seth Paulson, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Jeffrey Herman and Matthew West. Sebastian Samuel Rodriguez, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by James Schaefer. Justin Zadeh, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Eftimios Tsinis, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Paris Smaragdis. Zheng Kai Wu, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Payam Dabainya, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Zaid Kreshi, Doctor of Philosophy in Computer Science, hooded by Wen Mei Wu. Vikram Sharma Mail Todi, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Wen Mei Wu. Mayert Hidiyatogu, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Wenmei Wu. David Min, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Wenmei Wu. Eli Chien, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded, hooded by Olgitsa Melenkovic. Chao Pan, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Olgitsa Melenkovic. Hassan Buk, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Naresh Shanbag. Hong Yu Gong, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical Computer Engineering, hooded by Suma Bat. Wang Zhen Zhu, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Suma Bat. Suraj Jog, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Romit Roy Chowdhury. <laughs> Pratik Prasad Joshi, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Lara Waldrop. Parisa Karimi, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by 
Farzad Kamalabadi. Zhe Zhao Wang, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Pramod Visnawath. Ranveer Rana, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Pramod Viswanath. Ashok Vardhan Makuva, Doctor of Philosophy in Electrical and Computer Engineering, hooded by Pramod Viswanath and Bruce Hajek. Seyong Park, Doctor of Philosophy in Industrial Engineering, hooded by Harrison Kim. Jai Jin Wu, Doctor of Philosophy in Systems and Entrepreneurial Engineering, hooded by Ping Feng Wang. Yan Wen Zhu, Doctor of Philosophy in Industrial Engineering, hooded by Ping Feng Wang. Ah Young Kim, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Qian Zhen. Bin Bin Lu, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Qian Chen. John Smith, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Qian Chen. Yong Dek Kim, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Rashid Bashir. <laughs> Nathaniel Olson, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Jessica Krogstad. Tan Yuan Pan, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Charles Singh. Marilyn Porras Gomez, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Cecilia Leal. Corey Richards, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Paul Braun. Macbazion Sileshi Gabrai, Doctor of Philosophy in Material Science and Engineering, hooded by Daniel Shoemaker. Hussein Darir, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Gaid Delarud. Christopher Axland, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Kiruba Haran. Tarek Gabriel, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Kiruba Horan. Ignacio Erechi, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Catherine Matlack. Fan Kiat Chan, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Mataya Gazola. Tejaswin Parthasarthi, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Mataya Gazola. Xiaotian Zhang, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Mataya Gazola. Umnia Doha, 
Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Taher Abu Saif. <laughs> Ye Gun Lee, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Taher Saif. <laughs> Abdurrahman Faraj, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Taher Saif. Shruti Ganaka, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Tong Hung Lee. Jun Yang He, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by uh, Ivona Yashuk. Ali Kanj, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Same Tofik. Jad Yakub, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Same Tofik. <laughs> Muhammad Abir Hussain, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Aaron van der Zande. <coughs> Chi Ting Lee, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Zainab Madak. Erdogan. <laughs> Ahmed Samir Khan Mohammed, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Zainab Madak Erdogan. <laughs> Yinan Pei, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Elizabeth Shaw Wexler. Zheng Zhang Zhou, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Elizabeth Shao Wexler. Erfan Mohagehian, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Siddharth Ravi, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Zainab Madak Erdogan. <laughs> Samya Sen, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Randy Ewalt. Wenbin Wang, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Nera Hovakimian. Asif Tanvir, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Joshua Whitman, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Lawrence Whitman. Hajar Sharif, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Abbas Amin Mansur. <laughs> Chang He Son, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Placid Ferreira. <laughs> Ricardo Toro Santa Maria, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Placid Ferreira. Yi Lin Wang, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Randy Ewalt. Jianning Zhao, Doctor of Philosophy in Mechanical Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Gwendolyn Jin Yi Chi, Doctor of Philosophy in Nuclear Plasma and Radiological Engineering, hooded by Madikin Monk. (laughs) 
Wencheng Cheng, Doctor of Philosophy in Nuclear Plasma and Radiological Engineering, hooded by Zara Mohadeg. Darshan Chalice, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by David Cahill. Yao Li, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by Tai Chang Chiang. Pranav Rao, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by Barry Bradlin. We will now recognize graduates from the College of Fine and Applied Arts. I invite Dean Kevin Hamilton to come forward. Widya Ramadani, Doctor of Philosophy in Architecture, hooded by Lynn Dearborn. Isaac Brinberg, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Kevin Giraldi. Marquez Jabbar McKnight, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by John Myers. Drew Cox, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Jim Pugh. Kevan Faisi, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Jim Pugh. Reginald Lewis, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Jim Pugh. Joy Young, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Jim Pugh. Sing Hyung Lee, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Andrew McGill. M. R. Rowland, Doctor of Philosophy in Music Education, hooded by Andrew McGill. Kayla Solomon, Doctor of Musical Arts in Music, hooded by Amy Gilreath. Okay. Ryan, oh, sorry. We will now recognize graduates from the School of Labor and Employment Relations. I welcome, oops, no we won't. <laughs> we will now recognize graduates from the School of Information Sciences. I welcome Associate Dean Stephen Downing to come forward. Ryan Chandler, Doctor of Philosophy in Informatics, hooded by Stephen Downing. Hans Muller Paul, Doctor of Philosophy in Informatics, hooded by Matthew Hudson. Jessica Yi Yun Chen, Doctor of Philosophy in Information Sciences, hooded by Stephen Downey. Li Ding, Doctor of Philosophy in Information Sciences, hooded by Stephen Downey. Ling Huang, Doctor of Philosophy in Information Sciences, hooded by Stephen Downey. We will now recognize graduates from the School of Labor and Employment Relations. I welcome Dean Ingrid Fulmer to come forward. Chen Tang, Doctor of Philosophy in Human Resources and Industrial Relations, hooded by Ingrid Fulmer. Ki Jung Kim, Doctor of Philosophy in Human Relations and Industrial Relations, hooded by Richard Benton. 
We will now recognize graduates from the College of Law. I now welcome Associate Dean Verdi Winship to come forward. Christopher Mojave, Doctor of the Science of Law, hooded by Masuda Bashir. Vanessa Villanueva Colau, Doctor of Science of Law, hooded by Verdi Winship. We will now recognize graduates from the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences. I invite Dean Venetria Patton to come forward. Meredith Wilson, Doctor of Philosophy in Anthropology, hooded by Catherine Clancy and Jenny Davis. Adrienne Ertel, Doctor of Philosophy and Astronomy, hooded by Brian Fields. Jesse Miller, Doctor of Philosophy in Astronomy, hooded by Brian Fields. Alexander Gagliano, Doctor of Philosophy in Astronomy, hooded by Gotham Narayan. Srivani Yarugala, Doctor of Philosophy in Astronomy, hooded by Joaquin Vieira. Samantha Thrush, Doctor of Philosophy in Astronomy, hooded by Athol Kembal. Kianush Falakirakan, Doctor of Philosophy in Chemical Engineering, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. <laughs> Nabil Abuyazid, Doctor of Philosophy in Chemical Engineering, hooded by Mohan Sankaran. Rachel Lee Kimnak, Doctor of Philosophy in Communication, hooded by Marshall Scott Poole. Wen Qi Yang, Doctor of Philosophy in East Asian Languages and Cultures, hooded by Dan Sho. Anaid Bauer, Doctor of Philosophy in Economics, hooded by Mariano Spivak. Andrea Atencio de Leon, Doctor of Philosophy in Economics, hooded by Anahid Bauer. He Jin Kim, Doctor of Philosophy in Economics, headed, hooded by David Albui. Eduardo Medina Cortina, Doctor of Philosophy in Economics, hooded by David Albui. Maria Romero, Doctor of Philosophy in Economics, hooded by Nicholas Gatti. Hannah Elizabeth Darcy, Doctor of Philosophy in Biology, hooded by Philip Anderson. Lu Jun Guo, Doctor of Philosophy in German, hooded by Lori Johnson. Sean Ettinger, Doctor of Philosophy in History, hooded by Adrian Burgos. Emily Chen, Doctor of Philosophy in Linguistics, hooded by Lane Schwartz. Robert Dix, Doctor of Philosophy in Mathematics, hooded by Scott Algren. William Lintz, Doctor of Philosophy in Mathematics, hooded by Joseph Balog.
Amanda Erlinson Margano, Doctor of Philosophy in Microbiology, hooded by Paola Mera. And Shika Gupta, Doctor of Philosophy in Microbiology, hooded by James Imlay. Adam Nelzik, Doctor of Philosophy in Molecular and Integrative Biology and Physiology, hooded by Eric Nelson. Gregory Tracy, Doctor of Philosophy in Molecular and Integrative Physiology, hooded by He Jung Chung. Eman Hamed, Doctor of Philosophy in Neuroscience, hooded by Brad Sutton. Mikhail Key, Doctor of Philosophy in Neuroscience, hooded by her sister, Kendra Key. <laughs> Ellen Selinger, Doctor of Philosophy in Neuroscience, hooded by Janice Juraska. <laughs> Navida Chun Huan Wang, Doctor of Philosophy in Political Science, hooded by Alyssa Prorock. Makira Jones, Doctor of Philosophy in Psychology, hooded by Helen Neville. Shunak Bogali, Doctor of Philosophy in Biophysics and Quantitative Biology, hooded by Hemani Chabra. Alicia Alexander, Doctor of Philosophy in Sociology, hooded by Caitlin Clark and Daniel Wong. Hani Zayed, Doctor of Philosophy in Sociology, hooded by Asif Bayat. Kisurb Koei, Doctor of Philosophy in Biochemistry, hooded by Jonathan Swedler. We will now recognize graduates from the College of Media. I invite Dr. Amanda Siafone to come forward. Tiffany Bowden, Doctor of Philosophy in Communications, hooded by Travis Dixon. Olga Shabalina, Doctor of Philosophy in Communications and Media, hooded by Michelle Nelson. Okay. We will now recognize graduates from the College of Veterinary Medicine. I invite Dean Peter Constable to come forward. Andy Creter, Doctor of Philosophy in Veterinary Medical Science, Pathobiology, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Osgi Yenigun, Doctor of Philosophy in Regional Planning, hooded by Zeynep Madak Erdogan. Jonathan Echevers, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by Lance Cooper. <laughs> Luis de Jesus Astacio, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by Lance Cooper and Sepp Kuhn. Tyler Salnas, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by Lance Cooper. Sean Lahert, Doctor of Philosophy in Physics, hooded by Aida El Kadra. Sundar Namala, Doctor of Philosophy in Nuclear Plasma and Radiological Engineering, hooded by Rizwan Uddin.
Please join me in congratulating all of our graduates. I commend each and every one of you on reaching the pinnacle of academic achievement. Your Illinois family is immensely proud of your accomplishments and takes great pride in calling you our alumni. I wish each and every one of you success in all you pursue. I am certain that your future will be shaped by the very same passion and dedication that led you to earn your Illinois degree. I hope that you will wear your doctoral hoods proudly as you work, march into Memorial Stadium tomorrow for the university-wide commencement ceremony. It is perfectly commissable to wear your doctoral hood and gown uh, for the first seven nights sleeping after this ceremony. Congratulations. As we conclude today's ceremony, I want to thank the quintet for their musical selections today. Please remain. <laughs> Please remain seated for the recession of the platform party. Following the recessional, you may exit up to the concourse to meet your family and friends. Thank you again for being here and thank you to those watching by live stream for joining us today. Thank you. <laughs>